Thank you very much. How you guys doing today? Go ahead. Yeah. Have a good you posted a much better 40 time today. What's your reaction to that? Yeah, it's just something I knew I had in me. Um, you got to take the good with the bad. And at the combine, I feel like I did well on everything, but I knew my 40 had more in there. And you just got to put that in the past and prepare for what's in forward. And I prepared hard for it, and uh, I'd improve. And that's all you could do. All you want is improvement, and that's what I did today. Do you think um, I feel I did better, a lot better, but I feel like I'm very fast and I feel like I can run faster, but the 40 is done with. I probably never had to run it again in my life. Time to play football, and that's what I do best is play football. What did the scouts or your team say about your 40 and you know, what they most looking forward to out of your game? Yeah, so the scouts uh, believe in me. They know I'm very athletic, and scouts watch film, and they say I have really good film, and scouts, I just spoke to them on the field, and they said I look really good today. So that's all I could do is try to be my best, be the best version of myself, and that's what I did today. Oh yeah, the comfort level was on an all-time high. Like I'm, I'm back home. I'm back where I did this. I've, I've been here since I was 17 years old. I, I ran fast on this field plenty of times. And Coach Dillon, he's a big mentor in my life. And just being around him makes me feel comfortable. So I had a lot of confidence coming into today and doing those workouts. You also had Sam right next to your side. Did, did that help a little bit? Oh yeah, definitely. Just having Sam, having Joe Blake in my ear because they weren't there when I was testing at the at Indy. And having past guys like Joe Wilkins and AD, and even Jaden Thomas, who's not in the draft, but he's here just working. It just gave me a sense of confidence and comfort, and uh, it's tough for me just to execute. NFL running backs have to be versatile you know, more than ever. So what do you bring to the game that really makes you stand out? Oh, yeah. Like I've been telling all these scouts and position coaches and head coaches, I'm, I believe I'm the best, most versatile back in the, in the country. Uh, you got to pride yourself to be able to run the ball at a high level, pass the check at a high level, and run routes today at a high level. And I feel like I put that on display today. At the time you had at the combine surprise, like, were you expecting more like what you got today? Yes, it definitely surprised me. Like um, I was training for the past three months. I was never even in that range. But you have some off days. I'm human. You just got to bounce back from that. And, that's really how you that's really how you judge, how you bounce back from adversity and that's why I came back today and had a little better day. What encouraged you to declare for the draft after you know obviously high three season? Yeah, so um I felt like I was ready. Um I was ready to take the next step. Uh I felt like I completed everything I wanted to at a on college career and I felt like it was time for me to play with the best of the best and be a pro and it's time for me to be a pro. Well, well, you the, NFL you? Scout, well, the NFL scouts didn't learn about you today, they need to know. Um, I feel like uh, scouts in there because um, I type of offense. I don't really run a lot of routes, and but that's something I can do. I can run routes at a high level, and that's what I did today. And I believe that I showed them I can run routes at a high level today. Two more. Were you surprised that they didn't put like another container so you could prove the talent that you could actually <laughs> jump over defensive? No, I, I did get a little hurdle in today. I did jump over a cone, so that's great to put uh, all my tools on display today. What's next for you throughout the rest of the process? Just taking it one day at a time. Um, they keep on grinding, keep on training. The 40 and stuff are over, but uh, it's time for me to train for real ball now. I have meetings. I'm going to go fly out to the team, some teams. So I'm just enjoying the process as much as I can, and soon it'll be time for draft day. Thank you. Thank you. Never. Keep my tunnel vision. Thank you, guys.